Yeah, good day. It's Paul with Aussie Moving here, and we like to help people take the stress out of the moving process. Today, what I like to discuss is moving pianos. Now, when it comes to pianos, I like to break it down into two categories: upright pianos and grand pianos. Firstly, I'll go over how to move an upright piano. You need at least two strong bodies to move a piano because they weigh anywhere from 400 to 1,000 pounds, give or take. You also need a furniture or piano dolly. You need some blankets and shrink wrap to protect it. You need a moving truck or van, and then you need some ties so you can tie it off. Okay, so basically to move that piano, you just need to lift it up onto the dolly, roll it out to the van or truck, take it off the dolly, then tie it off on the wall. And then when you get to the new location, put it back on the dolly, take it to your new location and take it off the dolly. Okay, so now let's go over moving grand pianos. So to move a grand piano, you need a little more equipment and some expertise. You also need two to four strong bodies. You need a piano skid board. You'll need at least five to eight blankets and some shrink wrap. You also need the piano or furniture dolly. You need some tools so you can take the pedals and legs off. You also need a moving truck or moving van. And then you also need some ties so you can tie off the piano. So now what I'd like to do is go over some video footage of how to prep, break down, and move a piano. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to the video footage. Okay, so for this uh, demonstration, we have a baby grand piano. Uh, firstly, what you want to do is uh, make sure you move it away from the wall or any other items just to give yourself plenty of room. Uh, what we've done is we've put two blankets over the top of the piano to cover the sides. And now we're using a shrink wrap to, to wrap it to secure those blankets on there and for extra protection. Um, as you look at the piano, you can see the keyboard, which is one straight edge. And then along the left side is the other straight edge, which is uh, where we're going to place the piano on the skidboard. Firstly, what we're doing here now is we're going to remove the paddles. Um, and once we remove the paddles, then we can work along over to... Uh, the left leg as we see it um, it's important that uh, we take the pedals off because um, that gives us more room to pivot over to the side so once that pedals come off we're going to move along over to the to the left leg and then we'll be able to tilt it on its side onto the skidboard now the skidboard is basically uh, just about six feet long and now we're the skidboard Get on there. and what we're doing is tipping it over onto the skidboard yeah, keep the balance. and once that's secure on there we'll um, go ahead and remove the rest of the legs okay now as you look at uh, the piano you can see that we also have another strap that's kind of going around the middle uh, the reason we put that on there is just so it, it uh, secures the lid of the piano and makes sure you know everything stays intact um, what I recommend is that uh, you label the legs as you take them off so you make sure you replace them on the same place. Um, so we've got the two legs and the pedals off right now and then we're just working on the last leg, the top, and once we get that um, taken off we, uh, we have straps that come off from the uh, piano skip board and we attach it around the piano just to secure it on the board and then uh, once we get that We'll go ahead and get our piano dolly and uh, lift it up and raise it on that dolly and then we'll be able to move it out to the truck. But uh, once that last leg is off, we'll be able to demonstrate that. Okay, so now you can see they're getting ready to lift it up so they can uh, place the dolly underneath. Okay, they're placing the dolly underneath. Okay, now we've got it on there, so we want to start rolling it out to the truck. Um, so basically you just want to have a guy on either end, make sure you keep both hands on there and just uh, help each other out to the truck or whatever vehicle you're going to place it on. And uh, you know, once we get it on the truck, uh, we want to you know, take it off the dolly again. You can see to lift it up and pivot, one of the guys will take the dolly out. And so the last thing we want to do is secure it to the wall. Um, as you can see, you know, he's got the, the knot that we use. He's just gonna cinch it up, tighten it up, and secure it to the truck. 
and then uh, we're done. So that's how we uh, bring the piano onto the truck. Hey, yeah, thanks for watching our video today. Now, as a reminder that when you move a piano, it's always recommended to get it retuned. Now, if you need help moving a piano or any other household furniture, feel free to give us a call at 805-456-6498, or you can also reach us through our website at aussiemoving.net. Hey, have a fabulous day and thanks for joining us.